Good evening, everyone. It's Thursday, December 12th, and my name is Dion Woods with the Turquoise Cyrus. I'm the owner and artist here that likes to show up from time to time and say um, hello and show you what I'm working on. I do a lot of furniture projects. I also do some canvas work, um, and sometimes I'm just talking. Sometimes I'm just talking, but this piece we have been working on now for six different videos. This is number six. Um, yesterday we applied a couple of different transfers. Hi, Karen. Thanks for giving me the hearts, you all, whoever that is, and Karen and Karen. Um, so we applied, we, I, I cut up two different transfers, one being Wander and then um, one being Midnight Garden. I cut them up and, hi, Bob, and um, have kind of placed them separately. This right here, I just added. So I'm gonna finish this up, shift it around, and add a little bit of transfer and wrap it around there. Um, and then I have my sanding block, which means I'm gonna take some of this brightness off and I'm actually gonna antique the piece. I want to, um, I decided this morning, I woke up this morning and decided I'm actually going to antique it a little bit in some areas and create some shadowing and try my darndest to give it a hand painted look. Um, so Cynthia, the top is actually going to be stained. I made that decision today and Matt actually said he's gonna help me. So um, we're gonna get it sanded and um, we will stain it with dark and decrepit from DIY paint. Hi mama. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty, pretty excited. So this is um, part of the wander transfer here. Then this is the centerpiece right here where's the bird that is part of the midnight garden transfer. And then I'm gonna finish this up right here, shift it around, so let's get going. Enough talking, lady. Um, Matt is here, right, Matt? I am. Okay, so where is, here it is. Um, I have just taken this section here. Someone asked if this is for sale. It is, it's not a custom order or anything. Uh, we have three shades of green on here, and we have blue iris, and um, two different transfers from Iron Orchid Design. So hi, hello. If you guys have any question, he's here. He can ask me. I don't know how well he'll answer, but feel free to ask any questions. They're saying hello to you, right? Yeah. Yeah. Mercedes, she says hi, Dion. I'm visiting OKC. It's beautiful. Oh, it was a great day. It's going to be even prettier tomorrow. It's Mercedes. Is that what she said her name is? Mm -hmm. Awesome. Why are you visiting here, Mercedes? Oh, and if Matt, if anybody does the super chat and does the super, um, I read something today, they're called super images or super characters. Yeah, like super characters. Let me know because I don't want to skip them and not say hello. Got you. Got you. Well, I know this is going on. Are they already hashtagging uh, it's, you? It's it's crazy. They love me. He thinks it's like a phenomenon. They love you. Is that what you said? They love you. They love me. He was so worried. I haven't even been on camera yet. They love me. Yeah, why don't you get on camera with me? This would go faster if you would hang out down here with me. Oh, well, then who's going to read comments? Well, you can just bring all that stuff over here. Uh, just sitting over there in your cozy chair. I'm on the floor every night. Oh, she says visiting friends and looking to move here. Oh, wow. We have Allison. She says hi. Hi, I'm Allison. Away again in the UK. I've been watching our election results, so watching you is a welcome relief. Oh, I bet. Sure. We have Mandy from Australia. She's chiming in. Hi, Mandy Driscoll. Is it Driscoll? Yep, it is. Uh-huh. Oh, that's it. Uh, hashtag Mr. Blue Eyes. Oh, Mr. Yeah. Blue Eyes. That's going to catch on. I am going to do the transfer on the sides. Give me just a minute. Let me finish this up, and then I'll switch it around, and we'll do some on the sides. Oh, we got a hashtag Maddie Boo. Maddie Boo. Wow. That's yeah. an interesting name. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> You're such a dork. <laughs> Maggie Matt. Yes, Sue's right. We're gonna, just going to call it the Matt Show. No, we're not. You're not doing anything. I like Sue's idea. She's, she's, she gets me. She gets you. Yeah. Well, she can have you on her show. Uh, Mark Gonzalez says, hi, are you layering the transfer? A little bit. I am overlapping them just a little bit, and I am using two. Suzanne! 
Suzanne Hello. over on the YouTubes. She just super chatted $10. She's crazy. So, I mean, she's sweet. I met her in Zanesville, Ohio. Um, I actually had the pleasure, Matt and I both, of meeting Suzanne at Kelly Weiler's studio. And um, she attended our class, sat on the front row, gave me hugs, and um, anyway, Suzanne, honey, thank you so very much. So, Matt, we can give people a wrench on YouTube, and when we give them a wrench. Like a tool? Yes, it's like a tool. They can actually help us manage, so when weirdos come on there, which happens maybe occasionally, Suzanne says we're awesome. Thank you, you're awesome. Um, that we can give them a tool and they can actually get rid of... Um, Who gets a tool? Like super fans. Super oh, fans. So they can we can give them a tool. They help us they manage help, our yeah. page. Oh, uh, yes. Mandy Driscoll, $2. Merry Christmas from Australia. Merry Christmas to you, Mandy Driscoll, $2. Okay. That's so nice. We're going to get better audio. We're going to get better audio. We're going to get a better sound system. Saving up for it. Yep, saving um, up for that. I want to, because right now I have three different devices, and no, Matt did not fix the drawer yet. I have not. No, I will. This Susie says it looks awesome. No, don't add one to know if you fixed it. Last night I was struggling because the drawer kept going back. So once I get done with it and get it back out I'll to the garage, um, we'll, I'll let, I'm going to let him sand this. And um, it, it is phenomenal. Hey, we got something really cool here. She paints. Sure. Patty she Richardson. Paints. I've grown my Facebook page from about 100 the beginning of the year to almost 600 as of tonight. What? What? Well, Patty Richardson, she's in my group. She has grown her group from 100 to 600. I'm so proud of you. You've been working it. You've been doing lives and all of those things. I know you have, girl. Okay, so super chat, super fans over on YouTube. If y'all are wondering what that means, that's what that is. Okay, so this is partially, partially... Uh, Midnight Garden, Midnight Garden, and then I've kind of randomly placed um, the, the new transfer, Wander, and then Wander right here. So I want to wrap it, but guys, I'm going to actually be sanding this. It's, 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 um, I'm going to try to give it a look of a hand painted, and so I'm going to distress some of these areas with my block, and then I'm going to actually probably, oh, I may change my mind, but I woke up this morning and that was my plan. Um, but as I'm saying it, I'm like, oh, I don't know. Um, I don't know. Hi, Danette. Honey, how are you feeling? Max Smithers. Maz. Maz. Excuse me. Maz. Uh, hashtag fix it, Matt. Hashtag fix it, Matt. I got so many hashtags. Move that I don't know bus. All of you need them. like a shirt with like columns of, of hashtags about I don't about think the Matt. shirt's big enough. You don't I'm think the shirt's big enough? You're such a dork. Okay, roll it. The, the the drop cloth is kind of thick here. Okay, don't fall on the head. And so I think I finished with the Midnight Garden. I think I'm going to put... I really want the pink flowers over here. So is that a what I love... I'm doing great. Cancer can't keep me down. That's right, girl. That's a good attitude right there. Yep, yep. She had surgery the other day. Okay, so I am going to cut out some of these flowers off the wander transfer and then apply them to the side. Uh, Wendy says, or excuse me, um, yes, uh, Wendy Moore. Hi, uh, Wendy Moore. How are you? She loves the sanding idea. Yeah, I am going to soften the brightness of it, and then I'm going to put a dark. I'm actually thinking of using the clear wax and adding a little bit of dust, um, our dust to it. Matt, do you know what that is? We're going to apply dust. Dust? Yeah, is like that sounds fun. Dust? Make it magical. Oh my gosh, look at that one. Oh uh, yeah, Miss Mitzi Man. Miss Mitzi Man. Woo -woo. Looking beautiful. Love, love, love. And she super chat 10 super fan dollars. You guys, you guys are so amazing. Uh, here's one. Uh, teaspoon. I think she's in, Thank Hawaii. You. in Hawaii. Is she in Hawaii? I don't know where Teaspoon is. Um, she said, Matt, please tell Dion she inspired me to do a Marie Antoinette themed Christmas tree, and she loves it. Really? A Marie Antoinette themed Christmas tree. Did you print out ornaments and turn them into something, or how did you do that? Um, I'm dying to know how you did that. Thank you so much for that super fan chat money. I need to give her a wrench, too i got to figure out how to do that so they can help me manage my pain. Uh, Linda Hart Mullis, we are leaving the top natural, correct? The top is going to be natural. 
Yes. Linda Hart Mullins. Uh, Tasha Wilkinson, Wilkins um, on the YouTube. She says, I was wondering if the transfer could be sanded. Every yes. Every time I question a technique, you end up answering it. Thanks. I do it almost every time. I almost always question or uh, sand the transfer because I'm, I'm ultimately trying to make, make it look like it's been hand painted. So I'm gonna sand it down and then I'm gonna put a little bit of either black wax or brown wax, white wax. I haven't decided that part just yet. Hi Lee. Evening up oh, and coming have, power uh, couple. Alicia, I hope I said that right. Viola, whoa, where'd that go? Um, oh, thank you Wendy. She said Merry Christmas from an Italian in Western Australia. You're the best. You're an Italian living in Western Australia. It is so nice to hear from you. That is a quite the combination. Yeah, I love that. We've got people all over the world here tonight. Um, where is, okay, the tool that I was just using, you guys. Does anybody see the tool I was just using? It's right where you left it, baby. I know it's where I left it, but where would that be? On the floor? I know, but where? Oh, it's so under cool. my tush. All right, so let's get this on here. We're gonna turn it back around. We're gonna do some sanding and we're gonna do some waxing. Um, I know it's busy, but it's a happy piece. It's a garden piece, so we've gotta come up with a name. So we used Wander Transfer. We also have used Midnight Garden. So how do we combine Midnight Garden with Wander? Oh, I'm sorry, Teaspoon, she's in. Teaspoon. Kilowana. Kilowana. Kilowana, British Columbia, Canada. Oh, oh Canada's, how did you get that wrong? Canada's Hawaii. I'm sorry. I love to send you pictures. Uh, yes, please do. Send us some pictures. Um, Catherine Nolan, uh, can you use the transfers on fabric? Yes, you may. You certainly can. Questions are coming in hard and heavy. Honey. Well, you better go talk fast and read fast, Woods. I'm telling you, I'm trying to give up two devices here. Well, I'm catching up with three. How about that? I'm earning my money tonight. Oh, please. Thank you for your hard work over there, reading. It's tough work, but somebody has to do it. Yeah, I, I know. Someone has to do this. All right, what else? You're not reading anything. Uh, okay, hold on, hold on. Hang on. Uh, Okay. Hang on, uh, hang on, hang on. Carla, silence. Uh, so I'm on the fence about the Italian Dixie Bell. Okay. Uh, colors, but yeah. it will cost me quite a bit to get the beginning kit. Any suggestions on what size to start with? Do I have to make a leap of some kind? I've been talking with all the retail in this area. Um, I don't know anything about retailing Dixie Bell. Um, I only know, uh, I retail D DIY paint, and I actually just, I don't know anything about Dixie Bell, so I am not the person to ask that question. Um, how much do you love it? You gotta love what you sell, I know that much. You gotta love what you do. You gotta love what you do, and you gotta love the products that you're working with. Honey, we have got to make a trip to Canada. We gotta make a trip to Canada? Yeah, so did you miss I, a super chat, money? Did I not? Oh, no. No? no. Okay, no. all right, all but right. I have right, so all right. many fans in Canada. I've got to go see my people in Canada. Your people are in Canada. You're you growing my, your my audience. Are in Canada, apparently. Well, I'm proud of you, honey. I'm you know, I'm growing my network. Yeah. Yeah. Doing my thing. <laughs> they may not like me if I'm on camera. I may not ever be on camera now. Well, you did a really nice job helping us out at this weekend, this last weekend. This side is not coming off quite as easily, but I can't quite get, like once you start it, it's like boom. Look, see? Oh my gosh, isn't that so pretty? I love that fuchsia on the green. That looks really nice. Uh-oh, Wendy Moore, six ninety nine. What? What? Wendy Moore? Yeah, she just done it. She did great. She did that the other night, she too. Said, uh, you have what? any special family Christmas traditions she would like to know? Family Christmas traditions. Um, so, this is probably the first year we haven't done this tradition. Um, and it's basically because... Um, I think we just, um, the allergies probably of the trees, but I will tell you, um, what we've always done is we go to this tree farm that's about 20 miles from here and we let the boys cut down just a small tree, but now that they're bigger and, you know, like bigger than both of us, um, 
it's not as, well, it's not as picturesque, um, but we would let them cut down a small tree. And then we had a bonus room upstairs where the TV was and their video games and stuff. And then we would take that tree and all of their homemade ornaments that they brought home from school over the years, we would just designate that. We put the colored lights, you know, cause mama lights white lights on her tree. Um, and then we would put like all of their, we put like a little ceramic train set around it and stuff. So that was something that we've always done. But this year was the first year we did not get a real tree after all the years. So we just we bought one and then I have my vintage um, silver aluminum tree. So I have two trees up, but we did not do a real one. So we're kind of taking a break from that tradition for that reason. Um, we're giving our allergies a break. Giving our allergies a break this year. And, and not that we couldn't put those ornaments on another tree, but um, it's just there's something about putting it on a real one and having them all right there together. Because you know when I open that box, the tears start coming and all the memories. Um, what are some other traditions? You know, even to this day, the boys, even though they're older, they're 14 and 18, they still know that they cannot come into the living room. And, yes, chill. They and they will literally, now room. they text us. They used to yell from their rooms, but now they text us and they're like, can we come out? And last year, even with my 17 year old, he was like, get holding up. It's time to come out. Can I come out? And we were like, hold on. So we love that they understand that how important that is before they come out and uh, of their room so I can have my camera set up and get my lights on and, and everything that I want to do before they come out. Oh, Janet uh, Perez. Woo, look at what, this. Once your boys make you grandparents in five to ten years, you'll get back into those traditions. Oh, Janet, bite your tongue, <laughs> cutie. I love you, but you got to stop saying things like that. Five to ten. Maybe ten. Let's go for ten. My oldest is 18, so I'm going to go. That 10 sounds just fine. Uh, Diana? <laughs> okay, let's get this. Uh, where, where she, want, she wants to know where she can buy transfers at. Okay, well, you can go to ironorchidesign.com. And if you go to find a retailer, you can shop on online stores or you can shop at brick and mortars. A lot of the online retailers will ship to you. Or you can go to your local one if there's one near you. Um, you cannot find these in your big box stores. Um, Iron Orchid Designs tries to keep things pretty um, exclusive to where you have to buy things through their retailers. They really want to help their retailers grow in their businesses and their stores. And they really try to focus on small business ownership. So you're not going to find it on YouTube. I mean, excuse me, Amazon or Etsy. And if you do see something, um, it's not them. Um, it's a it's a similar product, but it's not theirs. Okay, so I'm gonna pull this off. I think we've got it. La, da, 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 da. So I love about this transfer is brand new. It looks literally like it's been painted. Like it's a it's more of a watercolor finish. You see what I mean, Matt? Like it it looks no, different. No, like you know it. what I mean? It looks different than the the other one. The morning it looks more past like has more pastel colors. Mm -hmm. in it. Yeah. So I'm going to, I'm going to sand this. Um, any question here for, okay, uh, I've got Nolan. answers. Uh, are you going to sell a beautiful piece? If so, what do you think you'll be asking for it? This piece will be for sale. Um, you know, normally my dressers are anywhere. This size dresser will be anywhere from 650 to $900 just depending on A, how much money you put into the piece, which there's two transfers on here, different colors, the gold. I've got to buy new hardware, and so it depends on what kind of hardware I find on here too. Um, but I, I'm gonna get this down, guys, before this falls and bonks me on my head. By the way, these are shipping out the first batch tomorrow if you ordered one. Um, So once I add the, do some sanding and add some wax, the hope is that this actually looks like I've hand painted the whole design on here. Could I have done it? Yes. But I'm trying to show you that even you can feel like an artist. If you don't have the experience, you can just use one of these until you become more um, maybe experienced at it. But they're really easy. Um, so Tasha, what's up with the money? It, it means that someone is becoming a super 
fan, they're sending super chat money. And so if we were working on things, like I have friends that are redoing a home um, and they're doing their videos on YouTube. So they use that money that they earn on super chat um, to, to work towards their home remodel. Um, I know that Debbie Beard with Debbie's Design Diary, she uses that money to help pay her employees, go buy them lunch, work on, they go to the flea market and come up with furniture to flip on here. And um, we are actually have decided we're going to buy better audio and visual um, systems for our live videos. So that's what we're planning on using the money for. And these kind and generous people on YouTube are um, becoming super fans. Uh, Marsha Dunlap, why do you stand it? I just want to. <laughs> Good question. You don't have to. You don't have to, right? Oh, gosh, no. You do not have to. I like something that's a little bit more faded. I want this piece. This is such an old piece. I want it to be distressed. Um, and then Gil, Denny Line Designs. Does the faded disturb the paint or just age the transfer? It just ages the transfer. It does not disturb the, paint, disturb the paint. It did sand it through here a little bit to where I can see more of the wood. You guys, my ultimate goal is to make it look like you think I hand painted this. And so I'm going to work aged, right? and keep getting it distressed, aged, and I want it to look hand painted. Um, you don't have to do this. This is not a requirement. No. Um, you, they would like to know what kind of, what, uh, what uh, sand grip 220. 220. <laughs> I love it. And then I'm going to end up putting some wax around here. Um, you can still see plenty of the gold. So let's turn this around, guys. Can you help? Um, I can probably get it. Or not. It's like, it's like a big ball of, um, of this drop, which we don't even really need, to be honest with you. Okay, perfect, babe. Thank you. And so, anybody get a song stuck in their head? I just watched um, Kristen Calhoun with She Paints. She was singing on the DIY paint page. And she sang, Mary, Did You Know, the Christmas Carol. And um, I am just like... It's, oh, gosh. You're good. You're okay, good. good. I'm good. I'm good. It's just running through my head. Okay, so you see how intense it is right now. It's really beautiful. If you want to, if you're done, you can just take um, a top coat, a wax, and you can just seal the whole thing, add your hardware, and you're completely finished. If you want to, um, which I thought about doing and I may still do, add. thank you for all of the hearts on Facebook. I really appreciate that. Um, you can add some hand-painted flowers. You could add in some other things. It will actually make it look more 3D. Um, but I'm going to sand. It's the first thing I'm going to do. Um, I do want quite a bit of DIY paint. Question. Awesome. I see you and your colleagues wax to seal. Does the piece need to be re-waxed after a period of time? Please advise because others on the internet say it does. Um, so you wax it and then maybe you will kind of buy re -wax it? Yeah, that's what people say. Um, but we have pieces in our house that I've never done that with. Um, you can, you know, wax once a year if you want to on a piece. Wax, buff, wax, buff, year after year after year. I've never done that. The pieces that we have, um, the one that's in the, the, in the hallway, in the entryway, babe, we've had that for about two and a half years and I've never reapplied um, wax to it. I believe that every wax is probably a little bit different also. So I always use a wax, almost always, as a top coat. I do like the texture of it. I like that it's um, distressed. No, not distressed. I like that it's not real shiny. Um, and I think it would probably be a pretty good thing to go back out in a couple of years and put a light coat of clear on it again. I don't see why not. Uh, okay. Um, oh, I got it. I got it. You got it? I got it. Um, I have a question. There was a question. Let's go back up. Uh, so can you paint over a transfer? Question mark. Would oh, you yeah. Say, would you sand it first if you did? No, you don't have to. I paint on them all the time. I paint flowers on them all the time, which I still may do that. I'm only sanding it because 
I like where it's distressed right here. You can see I wore it down, I wore off the finish here, and I just particularly like this look. Uh, Katie Blue says the share button has disappeared when I'm watching you. Is oh. it still there for other lives I watch? Any idea on it or how? I have no idea. I didn't know that it was gone. That's pretty aggravating. I wonder if it's just for you. Does anybody have the share button? Because I know I still have shares. <coughs> you got the troll, this, right, baby? Yeah. You got the troll? Yeah, uh, I think so. Sorry, troll on, yeah, on, the, I, on YouTube. Yeah. Suzanne said, get that troll. <laughs> Is there more than one? I don't know. Great sense. You know, great sense. So, a couple of things coming up. Um, I am going to be hosting a workshop here in Moore, Oklahoma, locally. Just me at Reclaim Warehouse in Moore. So, if you are local or you want to come to Oklahoma City, Moore area, um, in February, I'm going to host a workshop. You can. I'll be there too. So please come see me. Matt will be there if you're wanting to see him. He'll be there. You'll see all my lifting skills and yeah. my picking up techniques. Oh, dude, you blow that. Um, the blow gun. The, the heat, heat gun, gun really yeah. well too during my lives, during my classes. You do a good job on that. I can show. I can. I can. I can tell a bunch of my lifting secrets and you know stuff like that. That would be so helpful and valuable, Woods. I, guys, it's not very rough because I'm really not wanting to, but I know it might be hard for you to see that. Um, but we'll do some close-up pictures just as soon as I'm done, and I'll post them in community on YouTube and in the live on Facebook, and then in Instagram, I'll do the stories. Oh, I love this. Matthew, what do you think? I like it toned down. It just gives it that old, that age look, you know, because the piece is older. Yeah. And it really just, it, it doesn't look like you just, you know. It's not like too bright. It's too bright. It dulls okay. it down, but you can still see so it. You can it see where I've, I've yeah, sanded like this over here, and I haven't sanded this over here. So let me scoot my, tootie, my booty over here and finish this red. And I really want to start with the wax tonight, but I need to grab wax. I don't have it ready. I kind of want to do white wax. Yeah, it will. It totally works as a neutral. And every room needs just a little bit of color to give it character and charm. And then you're gonna, what color wax did you say? I think I want to do white. White again? But I don't want to cover up the gold. And then I kind of want to do brown, or I mean black. I don't know. Honey, you said white again. White is fantastic. I didn't like, say it was it's bad. Beautiful. I mean, just, you know, I mean, you know. I'm just you mean saying. you know? You mean you know? What I'm do you just, mean you know? I'm just saying. This drawer needs to be fixed too, Woods. Well, you, okay. I'll, 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 like, where? What do you do? I mean, do you use uh, the white and then would you use the top coat over that too? Is that what you do? No. no. Wax is last. But you're but you do the top coat on the top that you do the stain, right? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Up here, I'm gonna use dark and decrepit, and then probably a clear wax to give it some shimmer. Ooh, yes. I love the black and white. Kelly just says go all in. Kelly, Kelly, which one? Um, Kelly Bang. Kelly who? Bang. Oh, hi, know. Kelly. Go all in. Why not? I was just seeing if that was Kelly Weiler. Is uh, uh, Charlene Barbara Mason is hi, Charlene. Top coat, Char is top coat more glossier? Yes. Than the wax. Clear. Yes. Yes, star. Your painting that you have of Anissa's and I, um, it is got big top clear coat on it. Um, a Cindy Connor says use all three waxes. Use all three. Why not? Why not? I'm telling you, I love the way wax looks, so I may have to do that, you guys. Oh, Wendy Miller had a good idea. She says she puts zip ties through the holes. 
<coughs> in the drawer so you can pull it in and out if it goes in. Come That's up. perfect. Yeah, it's really Great good. idea. Thank you for that tip. Uh, Rainbow 505, what grade is the sandpaper again? 220. 220 grid. All right. All right, y'all gonna have to give me a minute while I get some wax together, unless y'all want me to wait and do this tomorrow. Tomorrow's what do my super fans say? Tomorrow's Friday Night Live. Oh, tomorrow's Friday Night Live. I won't be on here. That's right. How long would it take Friday you to night do a section of it for them? A section? Well? Just so they can get an idea. Do they, do, what do my super fans on YouTube want me to do? Um, they, they're wax. Keep going. Keep, keep going. Keep going. Keep going, girl. All right, give me a sec. Let me see. Um, let's see. We've got clear. We've got white. We have black. Ooh, what about turquoise wax? What? What? You can do a turquoise wax? Of course you can, honey. Oh, I don't know, honey. What? Did you just question me? Oh, man. No, I just That's said, probably a good decision to question I just said, I don't know. You don't know, huh? You don't know. Rainbow 505, super fan! What? What'd yes. Rainbow do? What'd Rainbow do? She gave us, she gave us a little contribution so we can get you some better uh, quality video. Sweet. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you so much, Rainbow. I love that name. Rainbow. It's Rainbow 505. Rainbow 505. It's so catchy. It should be a song. Rainbow 505. I can make it into a really good song. Oh, I bet you can. Yeah, I can. Where's my white wax? We can do country, or we can do rap, or we can do hip-hop, or R&B. How do you know how to do all that? I'm talented. Are you? Um, yeah, they, yeah. Say, they say just... Okay, just I've got clear, black, and white, you all. Oh, now you're just... Clear? Yeah, I didn't get turquoise, even though I kind of want to, because I've got a brush for turquoise wax there, there, there's a lot of questions on the turquoise like what what there are a lot of questions turquoise. yeah that's why not turquoise wax rainbow 505 she sorry guys do a hip-hop rainbow 505 song yo i can, I can even dance to it this too. is rainbow 505 no, hip-hop honey hip-hop like oh that's that's more rap i'm yeah, sorry i'm more of a rapper in case you didn't know um uh oh i'm not sure this is going to open the white Okay. Uh, Katie Sewell? 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 Uh, where do you get the different waxes? Oh, all DIY. They're all from DIY. We have four different colors. Someone says turquoise. Yeah. I yeah, got a right. lot of turquoises right now. Yeah, they just want to see the funk. Excited. They're like, bring yeah. the funk, girl. Okay. Um, I don't know about that, but I do know that I'm going to just kind of apply a little bit of the white. Um, Katie wants to know, do you, and do you have links for the different waxes? Oh, yes. I have a link, and I always post them underneath my videos, and I certainly will do that for you as well. You know, it's very a lot of people on, on YouTube, they're kind of seeing that they're right around each other. Maybe they'll get together and have a lunch or something. What? You mean they live near each other they're, on yeah, YouTube? Yeah, I think they're starting to figure that out, and they can maybe get together and maybe uh, have lunch and talk about painting. Or other things. Or other things, yeah. Well, and certainly. I think you can bring them together. That's, that's pretty, pretty neat. neat. Um, some of the girls from my Creative Connection actually got together tonight for a Christmas dinner. You know how happy that makes my heart? Matthew? Yes. Did you hear? Yes. Did you? Are yes. you sure? Your okay, heart. this is white. Okay, so you're doing, a, you're doing all three different Yep. This is white. Q's on here. Hi, Q. Tomorrow on Friday Night Live, I'm going to paint two of my lamps that are totally out of style. I don't like them anymore. And I'm going to blue iris them up, ladies and gentlemen. Q, what are you going to do tomorrow on Friday Night Live? Uh, I'm, so, I'm going to get this name wrong. It's T-A-N-I-A. Tanya? Tanya? Tanya R. What Tan color? It's... Tanya. Tanya, yeah. Tanya. What color lipstick are you wearing? Oh, um, it's Kate Moss from Walgreens. 
and it's called, I'm trying to remember what it's called. Um, I'm trying to remember what number it is. I think it's number six. Oh, uh, Mary. Mary, uh, she donated. Mary. Three dollars. What? Mary, super fan. Mary, what's Mary's last name? Mary Barricat. Barricat. Well, look at her little, look at her little bird. Dude, that's sweet. Queen Allen with the purple hearts. Hello. She, she's, she's, she's Michelle cute. with the super hearts. Uh, teaspoon Q is on Facebook right now. Q is on the Facebook. Teaspoon was one to know, is Q here? And I told her that she is on Facebook. She's on Facebook. Watching. Thank you, Mary. It's going to go a long ways towards this video and stuff we're doing. He's making me do. You guys are contributing and helping it. Okay, Katie... Asked on Facebook, I'm still learning. Do you relax every year or do you use no. polyurethane for continued wear? I don't use polyurethane at all on any product that I do at all. Just being honest, that's just not a product that I ever, ever use. And I'm afraid it will yellow and will change the look over the time of the, the clay based paint that I use. So, no, I don't use that. Uh, Lisa Schultz, do you buff after the white wax? Yes. I thought she was doing turquoise. No, you're wrong. I just teased you with it. So many people wanted the turquoise. Well, maybe we can hang tight, but right now I'm doing white in a few areas. Okay. Maybe. Will the wax dull the golden ticket? A little bit, but I'm getting ready to wipe it back. So right here, down here, I know you can't see it, but I promise I'll take pictures. The white dulls it just a little bit, and then I'm going in circles to try to bring it back as quickly as I can. So yes, it softens it, but you can definitely still see that golden ticket there. Again, I just my look is that I'm going for a hand painted look. And golden ticket is actually a top coat. It's a oh, it's a liquid patina, so you can always bring in some more if you dole it down and you don't like it, but I'm gonna leave all of that right there and I'm gonna leave all of it, it's still shining all the way through here. And when I rub it back, the golden ticket shows up all back through here. Oh, it just looks really beautiful. Uh, blessed Lives that just found you on Pinterest and so happy to see you live in action on YouTube. Oh, thank you. Did you see a video on YouTube or on Pinterest? I've been trying to get all my videos on there. Rita Young just joined us. She Hi, said Rita. Hello, hello. Hi, Rita. Is she on YouTube, right? Uh, Rita is on the YouTube. She's one of our super fans, I believe. I Yeah, I think it says Matt super Woo! fan or something. I'm not sure. It says Matt super fan? Yeah, I don't know. It's, it's a new thing. YouTube's done. It's I don't done. think so. I don't think so. I think you're wrong. Okay, so I've used white over here. I don't know if you can tell a little bit of a difference. I've used just a little bit of wife over here. White, wife. Um, Michelle's laughing at you. She's on me like that. Michelle Replogle. <laughs> oh, we got Michelle on here. Michelle. Oh, I see her. Okay. She's throwing out your hearts. Okay, so I'm gonna use a little bit of black over the white. And she, Blessed Life, said, yes, it was one of your video clips on Pinterest. Awesome. Thank you. I'm so, so glad we, you're watching. Whoa, whoa. What are we doing here? We're using black right here, Woods. Oh, we're doing black? Just in a few areas. Don't panic. I'm not panicking. I'm just observing. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Ooh, I kind of like that, too. Mm-hmm. More of a dark kind of guy than I am. Yep. I you know. Your favorite color is black. It's pretty good. Yeah, you like it? Now, can you, if if you like one or the other better, is it is it super hard to go over the other one, or is it easier? Well, you can actually use like I could if I if I get that too dark and I don't like it, I could put clear over it and rub it, and it would kind of pull the dark back off. It kind of works as an eraser. Uh, Dana Knight Barfield on the Facebook. Hi, said, Dana. Black always scares me. I can see why. It's pretty intimidating. But I wanted a few darker areas in there. I want a lot of shadowing going on, too. Um, I definitely want to put it on the legs. 
Um, and I think I'm going to pull a little bit up here around the top. So, so you can just do it in different like areas. You don't have to do the whole thing one way. No, nope. I like to put at least three different colors waxes on three different colors of wax on my pieces sometimes because Catherine Miles made a donation. Merry Christmas. Bring on the good sound. Bring on the good sound, Catherine. Thank you so much, Catherine Miles. You said right? Yes, Catherine, Catherine Miles. Miles. Thank you. Thank you so, so much. much. Okay, so I'm still adding a little bit of black, and I'm going to apply it in a little bit of a circle over here where there's not much transfer. So let me shift this just a little bit so I can reach it better and not get in your way. Uh, Kelly Bain, she says, Golden Ticket is a sealer. It's in the patina line, I believe. Yes, it is. That's exactly right. Now this drawer's just going, look. Matthew, look at my drawer. Easy, double, easy, easy does it, no, lady. Don't put your fingers in the top. Yeah, there you go. Easy, lady. That black looks good. With Doesn't the that look good with the golden ticket coming through? Yeah, it looks it's good. got a lot of great texture there. Uh, <clears throat> Catherine Nolan, uh, can you use wax on latex? I heard you couldn't. Um, I don't think so. I haven't done that before. Now I've painted DIY paint over latex. And DIY paint will stick to pretty much anything without any priming or sanding. I've definitely done that and then put the wax over the paint that way, but not necessarily. I haven't put wax with the latex directly. No, I just haven't. You, someone else might be able to answer that for me, but not me. Ah. I, I know you can't see it from this angle, but from my angle, you can still see all the golden ticket. And then we're just put, putting in some shadows and just strut, really antiquing this piece. This, this is like a favorite right here. Honey, I gotta find some really pretty knobs for this. Oh, I bet we could probably find some. Yeah, I bet Anthropology will have some, my favorite. Yeah, I bet they do. Okay, so I've got a little of that. I'm gonna do the legs. Is anybody still here, or is it just us? Yeah, we're down. I think we got just a few people on. I think they're going to bed, and they said, you know, time, All right, I'll be quick. To, I'll be to, quick. Time to wrap it up. They're getting bored, I think. Oh, my gosh. I love this. Black with the green. This looks so good. You guys, I promise I'll take pictures. This looks really good. Okay. I promise I'll be quick. So. Uh, Shelly? Hi, Shelly. Burgo? Burgo? Bergio? Bergio. No, Bergio. no, no, Bergio. Yeah, uh, the yeah, The transfer yeah. will stay on, okay, over the golden ticket, question mark. Oh, yes. I do it all the time. Look at this. Over the white. A little bit over the flower. So where I sanded it, it's going to pick up some of the black wax. Uh, these, people, these people are calling me out. On? What'd you do? I said that they were getting a little bored and they're they're getting on me a little bit. Were you just teasing me? I was teasing. We're, we're going strong, honey. We're doing really well. People okay. are loving it. So. Oh, okay. All right, all right, all right. I'm trying not to be boring. You know I, um, I have Con a fear. Connie Crenshaw? Hi, Connie. How long should you wait <clears throat> for the paint to dry before you put in the golden ticket on? Um... Honestly, the golden ticket, as long as the paint's dry, the golden ticket's good to go right afterwards. You don't need to wait. Now, if you want to wait for the wax in a, a 24 hours, I do recommend that. But I don't, there is really no need to wait with the golden ticket. Golden ticket is a liquid patina. It's a top coat. But honestly, I actually prefer adding the golden ticket before, um, you know, like as soon as possible. As soon as the paint is dry. Okay, I'm loving the black. This was definitely a good choice. I like the white too, though. You like the combination well, of the because, white? Uh, yeah, because it, it almost like it almost like highlights it like there's a like like a speck of sunlight, you know, like a ray of sunlight. Yeah. Ray. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Like it's just kind of shining. Yeah, you know, like through the woods, you know, you have when the sun's out and through like a deep canopy forest and like yeah. single strands of like light come through and highlight a specific thing. Gotcha. This reminds me of. Uh, Tracy on the YouTube, she said, I just Hi, joined Tracy. in. Are you using both black and white wax? Beautiful. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Little, 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 little bit. Just a little bit. See, like, I, I, I dot it in here, then I almost scrape all of it back off, 
then I still take it on my drop cloth and tap it so there's no clumps anywhere. Okay, I need to hold this in case this drawer decides to run off. Uh, Mary asked, she said, that is good. Do you use just a tiny bit of black? Yes. Oh, you just answered that. I'm yep, sorry. I did. Lisa, Worsley, yes, I will fix the drawers and anything that needs to be repaired. I also do some light sanding with some staining. Uh, a touch of uh, cooking uh, along with some laundry and cleaning. <laughs> and shipping. Shipping, labeling, picking up the kids, <laughs> grounding the kids, taking away the kids' phones. Multi-talented. Not our kids, honey. Surely not. Okay, I'm going to put some white back here on top of the black. Got a lot of people on really enjoying this one. They're loving that black. It looks really good because, like I said, the white on it kind of highlights it in some spots. I'm going to add more white over the black, so hold tight. I'm just kind of playing around because I can. Um, so, like, right here, I love that it's white here with the dark. Um, but I'm going to kind of come in here with a little bit of white. No chunks. Okay, so see how I did that? Yes, Queen Allen, that was a resume, but I come with a price. It's in my description, so it What's sounded that like a resume, yeah. <laughs> I am for hire, though. No, you're not. You are not. <laughs> I can't lose you, babe. I gotta have you. I gotta have help. You're good help. Okay, so I'm going, I like the white and the black over here together, but I'm gonna add some white up here on this total finial thing here. Oh, you know what? I just want to apologize to Instagram who cannot even see what I'm doing. Uh, Val Ward said the black makes it, makes it exotic and elegant. Thank you so much. I like that. Okay, I'm going to wipe this back. They're really enjoying the white and the black together, honey. Good. I think one uh, lady on here, I, I can't remember, I apologize. This is awesome right here. I gotta photograph that. And then Frazier uh, would like to know, uh, turquoise to finish wax on the final, maybe? Mm. Maybe, maybe. I'll think about it. I love this right here, so I need to move over here. And I love the way that the black and the, gray, the white are working together. So let's get over here and um, filter in some more of the white and black together. And then we've got to call it a night, ladies and gentlemen. I gotta go eat my figs and have my hot tea. It's past my bedtime. Is it past your bedtime? Okay. Okay. Gosh, I love it. I love the bird. I don't know what kind of hardware I'm gonna get for this guy. And then of course I still need to do the sides, but we'll have to do green that. maybe? Green? I don't know. Green like what? Glass. Green glass? Oh. No, no, I don't know. Really. Oh, I don't know, man. That's not a bad idea. I don't want him to really be, um, you know, stand real bold. Yeah. I don't need him to really stand out because we have so much color on this. Uh, Katie Sewell. Hi, Katie. Uh, are y'all East or West Coast? I think this is refers to us. I'm not sure. But oh well, we're Oklahoma. Central. Midwest. We're maybe? Oklahoma. Maybe? Central. South Central. Not like L.A. South Central, but... <laughs> yeah. Okay, now white. Uh, Kelly Betty said, your live is my nightcap. My me time after the kids are asleep. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you so much for watching. It's inspiring for me to try to continue to create, try to create new designs and stuff when I know you guys are actually, you know, interested and, and commenting and I love your feedback. Suzanne said gold hardware maybe. Gold maybe, yeah. Oh, look at that. Sea it almost glass. looks like it's hammered. Maggie said sea glass knobs. Maybe. Oh. That'd be pretty. Okay, a few more areas and then I'll pull it back, let you guys take a good look at it.
and then I'll photograph some before we get it. Yeah, they they would love to see some close ups. If, you bet. You bet. If, if you can't get the opportunity. Yep. You bet. Teresa Bolton, she said she's glad she finally caught your live. I'm glad you finally caught us, too. She, is, uh, she says your friend from Swansea, South Carolina. Swansea, South Carolina. Well, welcome. I'm so glad you're here. Okay. All right. I'm going to get some shadowing in there. Nice. Uh, Chris Butler says, hey, this is motivating me to stay up and paint. Well, don't be getting in trouble with uh, with the with uh, the significant other. Though. Honey, she's in Germany. Oh, that's right. That's she's right. in Germany for ten months. Well, you can stay up all night then. Or so. she's in Germany until I think October. I think, or she left in October. I can't remember. Chris can tell you. He'll answer you. Uh, Rhonda Church, I Hi, love Rhonda. how you keep adding when I would have stopped. The waxes add so much depth. I think so too. That's exactly right. It's worth it. It's worth it to just keep trying. Just like they're shadowing, it creates a little bit of 3D dimension. Now, if I wanted to, um, I could add in some more golden ticket, but honestly, I want this piece to look like it's hand painted rather than an application was applied to it. So the sanding and the wax really increases that look. Um, we will go ahead and sand this. Um, and stain it, the top of it, and then of course the side. The side, I'm really, really gonna need to fix that. It does not have any wax on it. So see the difference with the front versus the side. And I think, because I'm tired and we've been on quite a while, I think we should probably go. Yeah, yeah, let's call it a night. Let's call it a night. Thanks, everybody. You guys, thanks in. so much. I appreciate you. Hi, Stephanie. Hi, Michelle. All right, you guys, I appreciate you, and we'll be back tomorrow for, at 8.30 Central Time. If you want to watch um, me redo some lamps, I'll be on with Queed Allen of All Shabbed Out at 8.30 Central Time, and it's only on Facebook, guys. I'm sorry. After that, Saturday night, we'll be back, and we'll finish working on this one right here. So, you guys, be awesome. Thank you, Michelle, for the hearts. I see you. I see you.